Hello, my name's John and I'm the creator of the website caveofprogramming.com and this is the first video in a complete course on, I hope it will be a complete course by the time I've finished it, on JavaScript and Node.js. So um, I started web programming, I think it was in like 1997 or something, it was a long time ago, and uh, I couldn't have anticipated that JavaScript would end up turning into this powerful, fully-fledged language that you could actually have a whole career in. Because when I started web programming, and, well, for a long time afterwards, JavaScript was really a thing that you used to add a little bit of interactivity to websites. I can't even remember, really, uh, when JavaScript came out. But for a long time, it was a pain in the neck because it ran differently on different browsers. And it was a language that ran within a browser. It wasn't some freestanding programming language, but with Node.js, all that has changed. JavaScript has changed into a powerful, independent, fully-fledged programming language in its own right. You can create websites with it, you can create web servers, um, you can create desktop applications. In this course, my intention is that we're going to learn the JavaScript language itself, so we're going to be doing a lot of stuff on the command line, but I want to eventually, at the end of the course, show you at least one example of how you could use JavaScript to create, uh, let's say, maybe um, a simple website, something like that. So um, uh, I, my, my plan is actually to make this course, and then I'm going to make a course that isn't going to be free on React, probably, uh, but this is a self-contained course. In the next video, of course, I'm hoping that you'll eventually buy my paid course. In the next video, we're going to look at what you have to install to get going with JavaScript and Node.js.